Humphrey State University announced it has raised half the money needed to complete a renovation and expansion of its athletics facilities. 27 Sports' Brian Briquette has the story. Johnny, Emporia State is making a commitment to its entire athletic department by raising $210,000 to expand its weight room and other facilities to meet the needs of its student athletes. The plan calls for nearly doubling the size of the Hornet's Nest, ESU's weight room, to more than 4,000 square feet, something that ESU student athletes believe can only help their performance on the field. Teams are going to get bigger, better, stronger. Recruits are going to like it more. Going to provide a better, you know, strength conditioning program for the whole program and therefore we're going to get better as a team. Previous improvements to the baseball facility included new turf, scoreboard, and a player's lounge. With a new hitting facility project in the works, Coach Bob Fernelli thinks that this could only help the department overall. As a freshman in high school, to walk in here and see the, see the program now, the, the turf and all, all the amenities we've made, so it's been a great stepping stone for our program. Funding for this project is being done entirely by private donation, a fact that with the current economic climate makes the process challenging but not impossible. Fundraising Raising is never uh, a walk in the park, but uh, when you can find the people with dreams like we've had for a long time, matching people with the capability with the right project. Even with the expansion and improvements, head football coach Garen Higgins believes that nothing can be substituted for hard work and dedication on and off the field. You still got to go out and perform on the field, and just because we have a bigger weight room definitely doesn't put W's uh, on the board. I think there's a lot, that you still got to do the work inside the weight room, and that's what we've been doing a great job of. Now all of these improvements have just one goal for ESU, which is to get to and stay atop of the MIAA. Brian Burkett, 27 Sports. All right, thanks, Brian. Guy. Construction on some aspects of the expansion, like the new hitting facility, will likely get underway later this year, but other areas won't begin until the rest of the $210,000 is raised. So we'll keep our eyes on that.